Do you know over the last couple of days, all I've been talking about is, yeah, the Bucks beat the Brooklyn Nets, but I wasn't impressed by the defensive scheme of Coach Budenholzer. Mm-hmm. I, I really wasn't. And I kept talking about the fact that Kevin Durant, for as incredible of a series that he had, incredible, spectacular, he was it was a two-on-one most of the time because it was a high ball screen, it was a high screen, and then the big who was guarding the screen would sit down at the free throw line and wait for Kevin to come off the screen. That was Brooke Lopez. And I said, if they continue to play defense this way against their next opponents, if that is the Atlanta Hawks or if you're playing the Phoenix Suns in the NBA Finals, that's going to be a major problem. And once again, you even saw the guys on TNT talk about it. The whole postgame show is that when you allow Trey Young to start get, get cooking in the first half, that's the reason why he gave you a 48-piece Chicken piece, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like, he's going to give you easy buckets because it doesn't matter how good of a defender Drew Holiday is. It's two on one. The screener comes. He comes off the screen. Brooke Lopez wants to sit back there and wait. Trey Young's going to start cooking. That's how easy it is. Very, like, like very, him very easy. Him shimmy in there just waiting for somebody to come guard him. Jay, he's standing there waiting for somebody to come guard him. He did, like, loosens his shoulder up, knocks it down, and then he stands there still after making the shot like, anybody going to guard me? Like how, that, about, how about Alan when he throws it off the backboard yo, for Jonathan Collins to dunk the ball? Oh, yeah, that was – oh, the man. Oh. I mean, come on. It, it's like I a video that, game, I was kid. like, come on, man, seriously? It was disrespectful. It, it, <laughs> it, it, was, it was crazy. No, it was. It was, like, it was like playing at lunchtime when you were in high school. You go out to lunch and you play – with everybody else in the school. Isn't That's that, what that isn't was. Isn't that the point I'm making? That's yeah. the point I'm making, how comfortable he is at a place where most people might say, it's my first time here, this is the Eastern Conference Finals. Like, you get a little nervous, a little tight. He is so comfortable. Well, he's done it, like I said to you earlier, you take what you do in the regular season and you apply it to the postseason and you heighten it and kick it up a notch. So your confidence level, you, you done rolled through the Knicks, okay? You took care of business against the Sixers, although – Game six or whatever it was, he didn't play so well. I think it was it six that he didn't play well? No, it was seven. He seven he played well. He didn't make well. a it, shot, it, but it yeah, didn't seven. matter. It didn't seven, matter. he didn't play extremely well. He made a couple shots down the stretch. But you have that confident that, you know, you just don't typically see in a guy that doesn't project that star power the way Trey Young is projecting. Now, Key, he's Trae not Young, there 48 yet. 48 points. But he's on his way. Oh, Jack. he's there. No, he, 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 yo, he's not, there. Not there yet. Where, where is he? Wait, wait, he, where is he? He is there. Jay, where is not he? there yet. Where is he? Uh, he's, he's trending towards a superstar. All right, trending to, he, all right, he's, well, he's, he's blockbuster. Trending. If What's he's trending towards, he's What's the difference what towards, I just said and what you just said? I just well, said I mean, he, he projects if, there, he ain't there. If, so, 48 points, 11 assists, joins only Luka and Tracy McGrady is the only players with 40 points and 10 assists in the playoff game at 22 years old or younger. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. I mean, so that's. Is he's, that not the sign of a superstar? Well, he's he, trending there, you said, see, right? He's, he's headed I'll take it back. Direction. He's there. He's there. I mean, if you're dropping 48 in the Eastern Conference Finals, you're there. Yeah, I can't, I can't you're give there. him. I, I don't can't know how else him. you're not there. I love him. I can't give him that yet because he okay. got a long ways. He got a long ways to go with a pretty long runway, and he's going to be around but he, for a I long time. He like 29 this entire season. No, but, I understand right. that, but he's headed if in that gonna direction. If we're going to do this, uh, hang on. If we're going to do this then, because Key and I talked about this earlier, we both kind of defined – what we believe makes a superstar. So, Jay, what is your definition then? What, what do you need? What are the elements man. that have to be there for a superstar in your mind? Blockbuster. I have to want to come and see you play. You have to make me want to pay money to come and see you play for what you bring to the table each and every night. And if it's entertainment combined with dropping 48 points in an Eastern Conference Finals game and giving a shimmy to the two-time Finals MVP, it, it, playing with a flair – and and throwing behind the back passes well, that the like it is ridiculous. an AU game. Yes, I, this is this is different, man. I mean, he scored or assisted on seventy two points last night. So that's the most in the conference finals all time, Key. So all time. 